what is going on, y'all, y'all? Welcome to Miss Kids, y'all. Vlog. So, I just saw the Ellen new video, Get Me Good. And all I, all I can say is that she ever can dance her ass off. Like, seriously, she can dance. And um, all I gotta say is that it is about damn time that good music is out. It's about that damn time that Sierra is out, y'all. So I'm everybody talk about this video. The scope of the show was well, Kevin will talk about the video, and Messi Mal will talk about the video. So I was like, okay, let me go ahead and um watch this video. And I watched this video, and all I can say is that the dance was on point. It it, it was. And you know, ain't nobody can dim that feel but Chris Brown and Michael Jackson. Um, that's all I can say. The, 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 I left the video. She, I don't know where the hell she was when she shot this video. I don't know if she was in a dead, but she shot the video at Africa, but all the damn desert. I don't know where she shot that video, but I don't know. But I seen that. The sand and the dirt. I know it was hot as hell, and they was wearing fucking jeans and shit. So you know. All I gotta say is that her dance with team was on point. Everybody nail every step, every damn move. And 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 all I gotta say, some shit that she be doing like this, and you you know she gave me a little Michael Jackson thing, and you know. The little thing and stuff like that. I don't know. All I gotta say is that this song and this video is one of Ciela's best music video ever that I have seen so far. And all I gotta say is that Ciela, if you watch this video, keep it up, girl. I need more dance routine like this. I need more video like this. I need more slow like this. Um, what else? Keep it up, CEO. Keep, keep it up. I love the video. I love the song. I love everything. You, you. I, I, I like to care too little about the clothes, the little black shirt that you was wearing. But other than that, the song was awesome. The video was cute. The dance room move was on point. I just love everything. And I know y'all was hot as hell when y'all did this video. But that's not the case. Keep it up, Sierra. You did a great job, and I hope your next music video will be the shit, the hit, the whatever. That's all. Um, for those who watch the um, the Houston reality show, when it came on today's Friday, it came on Wednesday, Wednesday night. So. Did y'all watch the Houston family on our own? Tell me what y'all think. My opinion is that so far, even though it was the first episode, so far, I don't like Nick. There's something about him make me dislike him. I don't know. It's just my opinion. I don't know, girl. I don't know. I just don't know. Mm -mm. I just don't like fucking Nick. Which I don't understand is that the ring that Bobby's just in the head on her on her finger. She was saying that that was her mom and but after saying I'm telling her it's her engagement ring. First of all, how the hell that is your engagement ring and that's your mother ring. And I understand it. Then on top of that you got to buy a ring, engagement ring to order for the for order to be that engagement ring. How you gonna say stuff like that? And then on top of that, what Nick do for a living? What did he do? Do he got a job? What do this fool do? And to me, my opinion, they lost a lot of respect for Minnie Houston. We haven't pissed her because Nick, I mean not Nick, Minnie Houston raised Nick as Bob Christian's brother. Even though they're not a related to related or any kind of relationship or whatever. We all found out that Whitney Houston took Nick in at the age of 12. Then by me watching the show, he was saying that I wasn't adopted and da 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 Somehow, 
his mom kicked him out and somehow Nick and Bobby could skin him back and that's how Whitney Houston took him in. First of all, Nick for order for Nick for order for Whitney Houston taking you in, she had to adopt you or take custody of you. It's uh you can't just expect somebody to take you in and, and not to fight for custody and everything. That's what happened to me. Because my mom passed away when I was three and my aunt took me and my two sisters in as her own children. So she has to go to the court and fight for that and all this kind of stuff. So she raised me and my two sisters plus her on the child and she had a girl. So basically she raised four girls as a figure mother and she have to go to court and, and do all of that and so say that's what Whitney Houston have to do with Nick. You can't just say oh, I wasn't adopted. Oh you have to be adopted or she have to take take custody of your ass that come on. What kind of shit is that? But that's not the case. The case